earlier video I did say that we would have a look at um, the sketch, the Bernard Bin sketch and attempt to see if we can alter the meter band settings within that sketch because uh, the one I noticed most was uh, 160 meters, 160 meters top band um, it seemed to end at uh, 1.9 megahertz which was uh, too short for the band so I've just this is the uh, this is the sketch as I uploaded it to my uh, ATS 25 uh, looking at it via team viewer because it's on my uh, my other machine in the shark here so you're just going to scroll down here and see um, if we can see where the meter bands are I can see immediately um, if you've looked at the uh, the further information about the uh, the update video I did you'll see the retro uh, function that the radio has where the shortwave bands are divided into uh, night mostly night mostly day and so on you can see these are defined here under the retro band heading we've got the various frequencies here but we don't want to mess about with that at the moment um, so let's just keep scrolling I'm hoping maybe a bit further down we will see the meter bands themselves <clears throat> now then to go bandwidth settings volume settings ah excellent okay now there, there were two things that kind of niggled me a little bit about the uh, these meter bands the bacon band which is actually the beacon band so I'm gonna take the A out of bacon and just have beacon I think that makes more sense 160 meters let's have a look you can see um, here we are um, yeah I think I think this last um, frequency is the the point at where the band defaults to when you switch to that band this is this is quite odd really because um, we've got 1899 and yet on 160 meters we've got the band only going up to 1910 so it's um, not even default in midway is it I think this middle figure is the top end of the band so what we're going to do here I'm going to change this to 2000 okay so it gives us the full 160 meter band I'll just have a quick scan through I think 31 meters looked a bit uh, 49 meters if you're into your um, 49 meter band pirates and so on well you might want to give that a bit more headroom as well uh, we'll leave that for the time being um, 31 meters definitely I would start that at 9.2 or 9200 um, okay so that should work now uh, what we need to do is uh, presumably just save that um, hmm okay that's read only so that's okay so we need to well perhaps we don't have to save that I wonder okay for the moment I'm not going to save that I'm just going to try and upload it to my uh, ATS 25 so let's see how we get on Okay, we've got a partial success at least on this uh, little update I did to the sketch I'll just show you if we go to the ham now talking of ham we haven't got rid of bacon yet I tried to amend this to just read B C O N B con um, but that for whatever reason that hasn't taken I need to look into that but if we go to 160 meters let's hit that so you can see now we go right up to um, 2000 okay 
So you've got a full 160 meter band. Uh, previously it, um, it stopped the 1910. So that's worked. Um, also if we go to um, 31 meters, I think I changed that as well. 31. Um, previously when did that uh, that started uh, a little bit higher up the band I've set it down to 9.2 so we'll just um, I really need to do the steps don't I to um, to make it a bit quicker this <clears throat> let's go in 10 kilohertz steps there we are okay so uh, you can see now we're down into 9.2 okay um, so we've extended the 31 meter band um, I think those were the only amendments I made but at the moment the, I'm guessing it's a different part of the sketch where these buttons are defined uh, and not not at the, the same part of the sketch where the frequencies are which is where I try to amend this so we need to have another look at the sketch perhaps to try and get rid of that bacon but it's fairly straightforward as you can see to uh, amend these bands so that um, I mean the 80 meter band let's just have a little look at that is that set for the European yeah, maybe, maybe that goes up um, I think that goes up to 3.8 anyway goes up to 3.8 um, if you were in the US you might want to uh, take that up to 4 uh, to 4 megahertz so you had the full band that's easy enough to do Okay, just a little quick update on the ATS-25 with the Bernard Bins firmware.